So guys, welcome to the sewing part of this wrap dress. So now this is our dress. We start joining them together, the lining and the fabric. So what we are going to do first is we are going to add that. We are going to join the lining together first, then join the fabric itself together. So this is our front and this is our back. So remember, our back is divided into two because we are trying to manage our fabric so what we are going to do now is we are going to join our back we're going to join our back We have one full piece now for our back. So the next thing we are going to do, remember we are having that. So we are going to start imputing our that. So we'll do the same thing. We'll put the same process in all the fabric. In the front and the back. So we're going to put our dart in everything. So I finished putting in my dad for all my tray. What I'm going to do now, I want to assemble them together. So I'll first join the lining before joining the fabric itself. So I'm going to join my shoulder. So after assembling it, join the shoulder. I'll do the same thing to the fabric. The main fabric itself. And what I'm going to do next is I'm going to assemble them together. I'm going to assemble them together and I'm going to sew right from the place them right side facing each other and I'm going to sew right from here from this side from this down part I'm going to sew right but remember I have to put my strap here so before doing that I have to sew my strap So now this is my strap. So these are my straps now. I've eventually turned it in. It's supposed to give it a good press. Then now this is my lining and my fabric itself. Right side facing each other. This is our right side facing each other so now i'm going to start sewing it from here from this hedge 
from down here, this edge, turn, turn to the other neckline. So that's I'm going to start swimming. But before then, I need to put in my strap. So I'm going to turn my strap, put in my strap like this. From this side, I'm going to put in my strap on the inside like this. The reason why I'm leaving half an inch on this upper side is because of the joining. If I want to attach it to the down part, so I need to leave half an inch here. So I'm going to fix in my strap like this, put in my strap like this. Place this one on it. Then I'll start sewing too. I'll repeat the same thing in the other side too, when I get there. So I've done, I've joined the neckline. I've already joined the neckline. So the next thing I'm going to do now, I'm going to join the, I'm going to notch first. Yeah. Let me notch. It's always good to notch. So as all your fiber can, can lay very well. So after doing that, the next thing you're going to do is you're going to join them by the side. You're going to join them by the side. Now you need to join your lining separately and also your fabric separately. So you need to do that. Join your lining separately and your fabric separately. So you have to join by the allowance you put you put in so I added one and a half inch and I've joined use half inch to join here. I put in my dart so I'll be left with one. So this is the inside of the dress. This is how the inside looks. You can see how neat the inside is. And this is how the outside looks. So this is the inside and the outside. So what we're going to do, we're just going to use our machine. At this armhole here, we're going to join the armhole together. So I'm going to join the armhole together. Then I'm also going to hold it by the other side, the length. I'm going to hold it there. So we'll do that. So this is our front, this is our front, and this is where our one inch is going to, our hope is going to stay. 